Hello, Galaxy! I'm Chris Perillo, streaming live into your face! Possibly your ear, I don't know. I, I don't know really which which body part you're you're using to, to take in this, this video and or audio. Uh, now, I could be covering topics that you have probably already heard ad nauseum. Uh, topics like, hey, what do you think about the first public beta of iOS 13 that Apple released today? But instead of doing the thing that everybody else is doing, I thought I'd talk about something that I wanted to talk about. And that is, quite literally, the world's smallest pale specifically made for you to carry around an itty bitty lunch. A lunch pail that's super tiny. Fits in the palm of my hand. Let me go ahead and, and grab the box that the uh, tiny tin comes in. Look at that. There is a lunch pail and a thermos inside this little container. I'm going to go ahead and open the container to show you. Can you hear it? You gotta see it for yourself. So I'm gonna open it. And in fact, it's really cute because because the actual uh, box itself, it's it's like a, a little lunch pail, and inside sits an actual lunch tin with a thermos. It's like the size of a thimble. I mean, the thermos, not necessarily the lunch pail. Uh, you may be wondering, well, Chris, why why would I want that? Well, you know, let's say you're on a diet. You don't want to eat too much. You're consuming too many calories. Uh, you could limit yourself. You know, and sometimes it's difficult to do, uh, I, I realize, especially when something tastes good. Uh, and that's my problem. Uh, I tend to eat too much. So I have to uh, minimize uh, how much I eat. And, and it's helpful to have uh, these, these tiny lunch pails. So inside, <laughs> it's a little lunch pail. For real. Double-sided. Uh, this is a part of the Tiny Tin Pocket Pails series from, ironically enough, Gentle Giant. I didn't realize these were available. Uh, they just hit my radar uh, uh, late last year. And uh, they, they finally shipped, and Jedi and I have been having fun going through them. Uh, super, super tiny, super, super cute, super, super collectible. Uh, there are eight of them in total, and this is a part of allegedly Series 1, whether or not a Series 2 will be produced, I'm not sure. Uh, but inside uh, the tin, you will find, well, not really a thermos, but it's more like an eraser that looks like a thermos. Y'all thought I was, like, for real, like, with the tiny... Well, I am, for real. This is for really for real. Like, truthfully for real. Uh, this one is Princess Leia on that side, as well as on that side. And inside, it'll tell me May the force be with you. So you get a nice little message, an uplifting message, and then, of course, you can drink out of, in this uh, case, it happens to be a Princess Leia thermos. So there are many to collect, eight of them total, ages 13 on up. So, you know, don't tell anybody that Jedi has been opening these. But as I uh, pointed out, because I, I was trying to, like, save the surprise, like, each particular package, it, it's, it's like a little pail itself. And, of course, you can see... I'm knocking figures over behind me. Uh, the, all eight uh, to collect are on the back. I ended up going for the full case because I was like, well, I don't know if these are necessarily going to be very popular. So I thought I might as well make a run for it and just go and, and, and get the you know and, and the full box because that way, if anything, I would end up getting two of each, likely, uh, with uh, this particular uh, case. So and it, it, there are the features right there, too. See, there are features. Didn't know that. Eight different designs with the most legendary Star Wars heroes and villains and scenes. Miniature shaped or miniature scaled boxes made of real tin with a real working handle. It's true. Uh, surprise eraser inside each pocket pail. Collect them all. Uh, yeah, no, for real. That's it's like it's it's a it's there's a real working handle like right there. <laughs> It's just the neatest thing. Uh, you know, I'll be surprised if, if these are found in retail. Um, I, I probably wouldn't have found them uh, apart from uh, surfing uh, one of the uh, the sites that I happen to frequent for a lot of these purchases. Uh, hey, Mikey, what's going on? Uh, from what gadget am I streaming? I'm streaming from a computer. It's a newfangled type of gadget. Not as collectible, unfortunately. Oh, I like this one. This one has... Of the wrapping on it, but uh, Darth Vader, and I'm not going to open the rest of these, by the way. I just I just wanted to show you guys and gals, uh, Darth Vader and Princess Leia on one side, and Stormtroopers on the other. Of course, I was really kind of hoping for uh, a, a Darth Vader dedicated lunch pail in this particular series. Uh, Darth Vader does appear on at least two of these pails. 
Uh, like, I think on the other side of that one, that's Darth Vader and, of course, Luke from Bespin. And then he's, you know, there with uh, Princess Leia. They've only to, you know, stick it in my uh, Darth Vader collection. But since there are stormtroopers on that side, I wonder if this thermos, the quote-unquote thermos, the eraser thermos, is, uh, is uh, Vader or if it's stormtroopers. It's actually a Death Star on one side and stormtroopers on the other. And again, an eraser. That's probably never going to use. Maybe work as a, as a pencil topper with that hole in the bottom. Not really much you could throw in there. Maybe uh, like a Lego minifigure. Possibly some accessories. Uh, you know, certainly uh, it would probably match a scale for like 10 inch uh, figures or dolls. Uh, you know, anything larger than that, I'm not sure. Let's see here. Do I have a 6 inch scale figure here? Well, let's just say. Here, let's, let's, let's pull out. Pardon me while I whip this out. Let's say uh, General Akbar is going to lunch. See, it'd be, it'd be really big. This would be more like a briefcase, like he was traveling, right? And, and, and certainly that's at six inch scale, but you know, Chewbacca, he'd look even smaller next to this massive, this would be like a suitcase to three and uh, three quarter inch uh, Chewbacca. So uh, not really meant to go with anything apart from just having this tiny pail sitting there for fun, for kicks. For something that I can always enjoy and treasure, and now I'm I'm glad to have uh, shared my my lunch with you, if you will. Not the full lunch. You're not getting uh, everything. I, I'm uh, I'm probably going to stop opening these as soon as I realize I've I've opened the full set of eight, and I assume I've got the full set of eight with all the ones that uh, I'd opened in here. I'd be a little uh, off uh, off put if that didn't happen to be the case, uh, but. Uh, Yay! Tiny lunch fails. Uh, in case you were wondering, yes, I am going to be streaming a live uh, Star Wars radar discussion not long after this. Uh, I've got a few things that, that hit my radar. Not too many things, but, uh, you know, over the weekend, not a lot happened around here. But uh, I did happen to eat a tiny lunch. You can stop watching the video. I'm going to sneeze. And I'm going to close the video. I'm not going to sneeze. Spoiler alert. Oh, I thought I was going to sneeze. Uh, that's it! I love you, I appreciate you, and at this point I'm going to leave you to your own devices. Speak softly and carry a Wookiee, but try not to point it at people. I obviously have got a problem with authority. Uh, may the Force be with you, always.